Hey guys, today we are going to be playing some more Battle Cats. We are going to be doing some Into the Future levels as well as two rare tickets on the River City Clash capsules on the White Team one. Because I do want more of these White Team ones than I want the Red Team ones. So we're going to be doing the White Team ones, but let's go ahead and do some Into the Future levels first. We are going to start off with Japan. I've never done Into the Future before, so we are on the first level, of course. So let's go ahead and get started i don't think this one should be too hard i do know they're alien so that's kind of creepy but we do have castaway cat here which is pretty good against aliens i think he like freezes them or something which is incredible so yeah i'm just gonna send him out with some e shields and kind of hope he does good and i did actually upgrade hacker cat or nerd cat up to hacker cat and now i have him on my team as well because i do need some long range stuff on my team and that is a very long ranged unit so we're going to be using that cat in my new setup as well. I do want to level up. I think it's Hip Hop Cat too, because I heard that Hip Hop Cat was pretty great. So I do want to level that one up too, but I won't be able to do that until I get some more XP. And there is our first alien enemy, an alien doge, and he's already gone. So yeah, that level was quite easy, and I think that's going to be it, honestly. Yep, and there we go. The first one is down. Let's just go ahead and just hop into another, and we did get some pretty great stuff. And these levels, I think you get stuff based on your time score. Yeah, depending on how quickly you beat it, you get some rewards, which is pretty cool. I like that a lot. So yeah, we're going to be trying to beat them as quickly as possible. I should have brought like Lion Cat or Giraffe Cat along. But yeah, I do not have him up to Lion Cat yet. But yeah, Giraffe Cat would have probably helped get some time rewards. But I honestly don't know how strong he would be against aliens. Probably not very strong. So yeah, maybe it's better that we just stick to these and Castaway Cat. Castaway Cat can kind of just carry through the aliens. He should be able to kill pretty much any alien that comes out in these earlier levels. Even my normal cats can probably kill those, to be honest. So we should be good to go against everything. And then we should be able to destroy the base pretty easily. But yeah, let's see what comes out of here. And it is another alien doge, which just doesn't even die. It just destroys the base. So that is great. And we get some cat food from that. That is very cool. So let's go on into China now, which is pretty cool. And hopefully this one is pretty easy as well. I'm actually kind of hoping for a challenge. So hopefully it's not really easy like those. Those levels were pretty darn easy. But that is, of course, because they were the first levels. So yeah, maybe it'll get more difficult. It should get more difficult as we go along. But yeah, I'm not sure how difficult level three will be. But I guess we'll find out. I'll go and send out a castaway cat, see if he can just carry us through it again. And I'll go ahead and just meet shield. We do have a red rabbit jumping along over here. It is coming on over. But that thing is going to die pretty easily, I think. Yeah, it should die pretty easily. And one hit to the castaway cat, probably. Yep, there we go. All right, and we do have a pig coming out. But the pig should not be an issue for me. The castaway cat should be able to kill that too, honestly. It's good against even non-alien stuff, which is great. So yeah, we'll keep on sending out more castaway cats. And an alien thing should come out pretty soon, probably, since we are playing into the future. I feel like there has to be at least one alien per level. That would make the most sense. So yeah, let's keep on sending out more castaway cats. We actually have two out now, so I think we should be good to go for this level. I don't even think we need to send out any more stuff, but we'll keep on sending out castaway cats. I think that's the play. But yeah, it should get destroyed pretty easily. There actually wasn't even an alien on that level, which is very funny for an into the future level. But yeah, that's fine. Let's go to Mongolia now. And then we'll go and do a capsule after Mongolia. So let's go ahead and do this. We'll just start off with upgrading again and sending out some meat shields. Nothing's coming out, which is honestly kind of scary. And the past level's things came out right away. But yeah, we'll send out a couple meat shields just in case. Then we'll keep upgrading this. All right, and there's our first enemy right there, a sheep. That isn't too scary, honestly. But yeah, we'll go and send out a castaway cat for that. Because the meat shields, I don't think, can kill the sheep, to be honest. But honestly, they might be able to. That cat is tanking some hits. And then we also have a wall cat there. Yeah, honestly, those guys might have just been able to kill it. But yeah, we'll send out a castaway cat. That castaway cat should be able to kill them pretty easily. He can kill anything in these earlier levels with ease. So yeah, there we go. One tap and everything. And then we'll send out the ring girl cat too, just because we can. There, hopefully there's actually an alien in this level. There wasn't one in the last level for some reason and into the future. Maybe I just beat it too fast. I might have just beat it too fast. But yeah, hopefully there's... Okay, there's an alien, but I don't even think we'll need to kill it. Yeah, we'll just go and destroy the base again. That is the quickest way to do it. That's how you get the time rewards. So let's go ahead and open up a rare cat capsule now. We'll do it on the white team here so let's go ahead and roll this and see if we get anything good at all 
All right, and here we go. Let's see. Okay, we got another nerd cat. I'm not changing you for XP. I do want to level up my nerd cat. So there we go. Now he's at level 20, which is very cool. I thought he was already at level 20, but that's fine. We now have him at level 20. So let's go on into Russia now. Russia, I don't think this will be very difficult, to be honest. These levels are going by way too fast. So let's go ahead and use some upgrades or money to upgrade right there. And then we'll go and send out some meat shields. And we should be able to upgrade again. I don't know if anything difficult is going to be in here too, just because it's such an early level. You know, these levels are so early. But yeah, we'll go and send out me shields just in case. We do have a red rabbit there, but that should die pretty quickly. Even to the normal cats, I think it'll die to the meat shields. But we'll send out a castaway cat just in case. But yeah, it is already getting knocked back. The castaway cat should be able to take care of all this stuff because there's quite a bit of stuff coming out actually. But none of it is very strong, to be honest. So I think we'll be fine with just these cats for now. But we do send out a Ringo cat just to go and help us out just in case. Because I do think something strong could come out of there. I'm not sure when the strong stuff will start. But it will start one of these levels, I'm sure. So yeah, we'll keep on sending things out. Maybe these early end of the future chapter 1 levels aren't hard at all. But I'm hoping that there's at least a little bit of a challenge somewhere in here. Maybe the moon will be hard. I'm not sure what is on the moon in Into the Future. But maybe it'll be something hard. We did actually get an Uber out, so I don't know about that. Okay, just a red seal is coming out. The red seal should be taken care of pretty easily, especially with that Uber. There's no way it's going to get past the Uber. So yeah, the red seal should die pretty quickly. It died before the Uber even got up there. So yeah, pretty easy with that. Let's go ahead and just keep sending things out. Let's send out the laser, and it should get taken care of in just one swing from that Uber. There we go. Yep, that got it taken care of real quick. And we got a cat CPU, which is cool, I guess. I don't really need more of those. Yo, we actually are out of energy. Um, Actually, I'm going to go ahead and just use one of these. I'll go and use one of those so that I can make the video a little bit longer, because it is pretty short so far, because we are running through these levels so quickly they're not taking that much time at all normally the levels take so much longer so we're not able to do as many in a video but yeah we'll go ahead and just do this level two uh we are on norway now i'm not sure how hard norway is gonna be but we do start off with a hippo that hippo could be quite difficult i don't know i'm gonna send out a castaway cat again it should take care of that hippo pretty easily so let's go ahead and just send that out and it should kill the hippo one swing again. Everything just gets one tapped by the castaway cat. It is far too strong for these levels. So yeah, let's go ahead and send out some more stuff. We'll just send out everything we can. Oh, and there's actually a hippo alien. That's interesting. That might be more difficult. Maybe not though. It's actually not killing much. But yeah, it's more difficult than the doges. There we go. Okay, we knocked it back. It didn't die in one hit. That's a good sign. Okay, and the Castaway Cat will keep on hitting it. It does actually freeze him, which is great. I really like that. So there we go, and it's gone. That wasn't that hard, but it was cool to see, okay? It was very cool to see. It doesn't have to be hard. Okay, and we got 10 cat food. Cool, and a cat ticket. Very fun. Okay, let's go ahead and return, and we will do the United Kingdom as well. This will probably be the last one in this video, and then we'll go and do a roll, and we'll end it up on that roll. So let's go ahead and do the United Kingdom We'll see if there's anything strong in there. I see a little star up there on top of the base. Not sure if that means anything. Probably not. But yeah, for now, we're just starting off with some basic enemies. Uh, those aren't hard at all. They should get taken care of really easily. We'll also send out a castaway cat just so that it can wipe them up. And then we'll also just send out some other stuff like artist cat's cool. We'll send out a Maasai cat, right? A Maasai cat. I remembered its name for once. That's neat. So we'll keep sending out some random cats, random rares. And that should be good enough, I think, honestly. Um, maybe something big will come out, though. Okay, just a bunch of the alien doges. That's not that scary, honestly. But we can get rid of... Actually, we don't even need to get rid of them. The base just goes down. That's very neat. So, there we go. And we get some cat food from that, too. Very cool. I like getting cat food from these levels. That is very fun. Okay, and then let's go on in here. And we'll do the rare cat capsule. And then we'll also do the basic cat capsule we got from that level. So, let's do the rare cat capsule first. And we'll see if we get anything good. Okay, witch cat, that's not good. Okay, get rid of you. We can get some free XP from that. So that's good, of course. And then let's do the normal cat capsule right here. Maybe we'll get something good out of this. Any of the basic cats would be good. Actually, anything would be good, honestly. Okay, cat cannon charge. That's pretty good. I like that. All right. And there we go. Let's go ahead and just do another level before we end it, actually, since it's still a pretty short video, to be honest. And we got more energy to play with. So let's do one more level real quick. Okay, this one could be hard. It is pretty close together to the enemies, which is a little scary. I do get a little scared when I see a level like that. So that could be bad for us. 
But honestly, after the last levels, I'm not sure if anything's really going to come out of it. But yeah, we'll see. Let's go ahead and send out some basic cats, some normal meat shield cats. And we just have a red bunny running out at us. That's a little scary, I guess. And yep, let's go ahead and keep sending them out. And maybe we can get rid of those red bunnies. The uh, castaway cat should be able to get rid of them, right? Yep, there's one. And the other one just died to the meat shields. Then we can send out a ring girl cat. Send out some rare cats. And we should be good to go. Honestly, oh, a red rhino. That isn't an alien. I'm not sure why it's in here. But yeah, we should be able to kill that too pretty easily. Since these aren't super hard levels. So it, I think it's like easy mode health. I don't know how to say it, Like chapter one health. I don't know what it's actually called, but they're weaker enemies than normal than like the chapter three enemies or even the stories of legend enemies, I think are stronger than these. Yeah, and it died pretty quickly. So yeah, we can go ahead and clean up, finish up this level pretty quickly. There we go. And what do we get from that one? We get some speed ups, I guess, or one speed up. That's right. I don't use power ups at all, if you couldn't tell, though. So I don't really care about that. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see me do some more into the future. We actually got through quite a few levels there. Wow, we got through a lot. So, subscribe for the next ones, and maybe we'll make it to the moon at some point. We probably will. So, let me know down in the comments what you guys thought of this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.